Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Atlas. I'm the Radio Man 03. It's awesome to have you along. Hope you had a great weekend. I did. Had a lot of fun with uh, the group playing some Seven Days to Die. Mm -hmm. And now we're back in Atlas. Indeed. I'm kind of working on trying to finish this up as much as possible. I don't know exactly what I'm going to do with all this space up here, but it'll come to me. Uh, what I'm working on right now is the vents for the forge area down below. you got to be careful on these half walls. When you stand on them, they want to slide you up a little bit, which is normal for the walls to do. So you got to be careful about that. Uh, I am working on, yeah, like I said, a little vent thing. The forges, they did move again, uh, but we, we brought pillars up, and that's what made things look a little bit different, and I had to move the forges one more time. So all I was going to do here was inventory... I'll make this as simple as possible. I'm going to roof this side of it. Like so. Can I get one more over here? I might be able to. I think I have everything I need in order to uh, hopefully get this just about finished up. And then we're going to want this to come right up against here like so. Uh, you stay open. There we go. Uh, I can turn my light off. I uh, hope everyone is, is doing great. I am doing quite well, indeed. It's Monday. Mm-hmm. I just ca jumped in and kind of got going again. And I'm warming back up. I'm doing the solid stone walls up here just to bring a little bit of the stone up to this level right here. And let's bring this down to the corner. Uh, if I hit Q, what does it do? Yeah, no, it's going to have to be the other one. And then Q. Oh. Hmm, now I can't seem to get that one to snap into where I want it to be in. Okay, so let's try the other one. Nope. Oh, I've just done this three times. Okay, so how about that one? It still wants to pop out. Maybe if I have the ceiling on here, that'll help guide it into the spot it's supposed to be in. It's really kind of picky. you got to watch it, too, because it'll, it'll go the wrong way on you. Uh, let's try it one more time from here and see. It's usually user error. Q. Okay, that one looks good there. There we go. All right, perfect. Yeah, we are going to go uh, attack the pirate camp today and see if we can't uh, cause them some problems. Indeed, we are. Uh, I would love to be able to shut that one down. Let's go to number six. Uh, if I hit Q, hmm, let's put the roof on that away, huh? I don't want the roof on that way. Maybe if I go over to this one here. So we've got all the slats going this direction. I've been really pleased with that. And now this one here is just not going to do what I want it to do. Hmm. I'm not sure what to do about that. I wonder if maybe if I took something off and put something back on, if it would have worked. I don't know in the grand scheme of things if that's going to be very important because we're really not going to see that. We're going to put these all in a pin cone with a, le a lever downstairs. We don't have to do any of this for uh, this particular thing. We don't. I'm just doing it because I want to. Uh, would have stairs. Let's get those out of here. We're going to get rid of those all together, and then that's going to be the enclosure over the top of the furnaces. So uh, all these will open up with the pin codes. Uh, from a lever downstairs, and this will be ventilation for up in this area. I thought that would be nice to give kind of the second area here just a little uh, little something different to look at when you're looking. Uh, we're going to have the farms and stuff up here. It's going to look really good, I think, once it's uh, a little further along. Uh, and then over here, I am definitely thinking about taking this shape and carrying it all the way down this side as well as the other side over there too. Not across the front so much. So across the front by the big stone door, I'll do something different there. But for the most part, I would like to have this sort of a design going further down this way along the edge. And I think what I might do is turn that into a portion of like my quarters and we'll probably take some of these windows out and put something else in. Maybe not. I don't know. 
up here it seems like this is exactly where you'd want people looking out and, and, and firing from and stuff like that up here you know it just makes sense to have that uh, we've got that little kind of a crow's nest up there the thing is is I would really love to incorporate yeah see I don't know about that I think I'm gonna be good with our original plan I think let's get a couple more uh, I would like four more stone walls I think that's got us just about enclosed. Uh, this edge, I'm kind of leaving alone at the moment to see what I'm going to do. I'm pretty sure that all I'm going to do is continue this on, and it's going to jump up as we go along down this as well, and it'll do the same thing on that side too. Uh, it'll just jump up a little bit. Um, yeah, let's get a few more stone walls. I think I might have some in here. We've kind of gone through what I had. Mm, no, but we'll grab that guy. I don't see the walls, so let's see. Can we make some stone walls? I think we can. 28 of them. Let's, uh, let's craft them all. We'll do that. I don't plan on doing too much building this episode. I thought we'd do a little bit together here, and then we'll move forward and go see about taking on those pirates over there. I did want to get the forges up and running again. I don't have to have the, the door vent at the moment. Uh, I think that's probably going to be enough, huh? Yeah, I'm encumbered right there with that, so that's going to be too heavy. Let's drop that. And this back in here. How are we doing? Uh, I'm not running very fast, but I'm doing okay. Do I have a lever? Um, bum, bum, bum. This first day, I thought we'd do this together. Uh, yeah, there we go. Perfect. All right, I just need the one. I wonder if I should set the lever first. Probably so. Let's set the lever first and we'll decide what we're going to do with the... Uh, I think we'll just make it like 5, 5, 5, 5, 5 or whatever. Four. Okay, so as I come through here, I'm going to be exiting on this side here. One of you mentioned that maybe the arrow on the lever is why uh, the doors open in instead of out. If I had placed them maybe this way with the green arrow this way, if that would have made a difference. Uh, I guess we could find... Well, let's let's be consistent at least back here. This is just to open and close these doors above us. It's not like it's going to actually open uh, the main door. Uh, so we're going to need a pin code. And we'll make this one all fives. There we go. And then we'll have to do that with the doors upstairs. Um, did I pick something up that got me extra heavy? Hmm. I didn't think I did. I guess I'm running again. There we go. Never mind. Felt like I was moving really super slow. Uh, okay, right here is one thing I wanted to do. Number five. I want to go with these guys right here. Uh, come on, please. Please do this for me. There you go. That's it. You were you were in this right spot there for just a second. Let me, if I hit Q. It's, it's, I think it's because I've got, um, what if I go Q up here? I got that there. Okay, so I could do that right there. Okay, so it's probably the rail that's kind of getting in the way a little bit. Let's see, how's that look on this side? It should be right. I think that looks great. Okay, that's what I wanted to do there, just to clean up those weird edges that are there. Um... Number six, I think what we could do here is we could continue. I don't have any wood walls. I need a wood wall for there, and then I need... I'm going to go like that right there. Okay, then I need a wood wall there, and I think, yeah, this tree is going to have to go, of course, and then this is going to have to go out two more. Uh, to make a complete, I believe it is two, it might be more than that, one, two, three, no, it's three, three wide, so this has to be a three wide uh, overhang off, off of this right here, so we've got to go three more out and then make our turn, so all this space is really our space right here, all of it is, number six, I think I'm safe with putting these in first, I don't think it's going to be that big of a deal, I should be able to come back with the wood walls and fix that up, Okay, so here we're going to go to the pin code. There we go. And again. All right. 
Just a few more to go. <laughs> I know. For something that we don't even need. It's pretty fun, though. I think they look nice. They'll probably spend a lot of time open. I was uh, looking at the, the uh, stone structure stuff. And it is, uh, it takes a lot of um, forged ingot to, to make some of the stuff. For sure, if you want to build out of the stone, it's, it's a little expensive. But that's okay, we can, we can afford to do that. Alright, so we're good to go there. This should open all of those when we pull the lever. Let's get over here. Can't really see. There they are, though. They're all open. Did we get them all? We did. Okay, beautiful. And then close. Yeah. All right. Awesome. Okay, that takes care of that. All right. You actually have a bunch of stuff that I need. Oh, I'm encumbered already. In order to get these things fired up again, because we're gonna make we're gonna make a cannon, and I think I'm gonna make that small swivel cannon too. It's not a cannon though; it's it's a it's a gun basically. It's a gun. Uh, I'm gonna make those, and then I want to take those with us, and we're gonna try them out on this first pirate camp and see what do we have to do to my biggest goal. Of course, is to knock that girl off the uh, off that ledge. I need to move her down this way. Come on, Belma. <clears throat> She's very tough to move, but she's got a she's got a level. Uh, and and note to myself, next time I will go an extra block higher, uh, just to avoid from having this uh, kind of thing happening right here, where we're kind of in the ceiling a little bit, you know. Uh, wow. Okay, she is so big. <laughs> All right, I'll be back in just a second. Let me get a few things put together, and then we'll uh, we'll head out the door and go fight some pirates. Here we are in the fog. Heading into a fight, six boars and an elephant behind us. We'll see if we can actually get there with them. <laughs> it's pretty tight quarters. Valma's having some serious troubles back there. I could probably get on her and knock out some of these trees. She finds a way, but you just got to give her time to do that. That's all. They're very eager to stay right with Ludo and myself. We're coming up on it pretty close now. Uh, yeah, I know. We're losing we're losing critters back here. There's a cobra coming in. Level 4. Hmm. That cobra doesn't stand a chance. There we go. Good job, Belma. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Let's go get some. Oh, that was a direct hit. Oh, this place looks a little bit different. F2. I can't see anything. I am so buried in everybody here. We'll worry about the cannons and everything else after we're done with this. I brought nobody good with us. I've, all the expendables are here with us right now. Oh, you're doomed. You're doomed, heavy pirate. Uh-oh, oh, 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 oh. We got, we got a stuck elephant over here. No, you're going to both die for that. You were rough on Velma. Okay, so let's go to our inventory. That cleans that mess up. I'm going to put this down here, number three, where it's supposed to be. Do we have any of these guys left? Uh, no one up in the tower this time. That's interesting. Did they remove the... T oh, jeez, look out. There's a guy with a cannon. <laughs> okay. You know what? We should see. Can we knock him down with the cannon? 
Everybody come to me. Oh, you know what? Let's just hit you. Everyone's kind of fine just where they are. Uh, let's go E. Let's get on here. There we go. All right, so we got a guy up there in a cannon. Let's see if we can use Bluto to knock these guys out of the can. Some of the, the, the places are not occupied like they were last time. I mean, granted, there were a lot of pirates here, but um, some of the higher spots they're not in. Either that or Belma got them off of there and I just didn't see it. I'll have to look back. We've got two guys up on these rooftops over here. So let's see if we can do the cart thing with Bluto. Here we go. Oh, and there's a guy in the house too. So we're going to need this anyway. So let's go ahead. I've got the cart. And I've got a cannon. Let's go ahead and do... Oh, there's, there's a... Do we get this stuff at all? There was a time when we were getting uh, clothing and stuff off of these guys that first time. But I don't see anything on anybody this time around. What's that? Was that a big old bug flying through here? Oh, it's a rabbit. Do you have things on you? You don't. Okay, so do we not get the gear from them anymore? Maybe we don't. It looks like we're not. Or that's going to be something that they're working towards uh, again. Or getting worked out. I don't know. I don't know. Number six. I want it to face backwards. You guys told me if the ammunition is on Bluto, then it should work. So let's go ahead and take this over to here. Line ourselves up real nice. He can't quite turn all the way over to us, which is great. You're not set to follow. Mount cannon. Reload. Oh boy. Let's see if this gets him off of there. Okay, that was high. That was high. I'll, I'll give that. It was high. Oh. Okay, but it did not knock him off of there. Let's try a little bit higher. That one passed him. Okay, so I know I can cut them down, but I can't use a cannon to get them off of there. That's kind of interesting, I think. That went right over her head. That causes a ton of damage. All right, so we've got to cut those two down. Let's let's go ahead and do that. Let's go cut them down. Uh, we'll just draw them into us. We're gonna have to need. Oh, you know what? I also did today, and I let's let's try this out. Yeah, that didn't do anything. He's... That's kind of weird that we can't get them down. The carbine. I made the carbine and some ammunition. It's the mini rounds. We are going to have to get that guy out of there, so I want to kind of save the cannonballs for that, because I have a feeling I'm going to need them. We're going to go up there and just give these guys a slice with the sword. Oh, we got them both down that time. Pretty cool. Ah! F2. Okay, so she blocked a couple of hits from Bluto with her shield, I think. You guys haven't taken care of him yet. We're gonna get these guys lined up here. They'll get him. Whoa, 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 whoa. And we're gonna set you up right here. Now, last time we did this, I was causing damage to the building with my axe. Two per hit. You can see the number going down. That's going to take a lot. Let's see what we can get done with this here cannon. <laughs> Let's see if we can knock up properly. Uh, oh, I can't be on. Come on now, what are you doing? All of a sudden, all the wrong buttons. Let's, let's do this here. Mount the cannon. Reload. Hmm. 
Now I'm wondering, should I aim at this wall right here? Would that be easier? <laughs> I don't know. I seem to be getting a lot more over here. I would think that roof, I don't know, there might be a stone roof right there too. Let's try from another angle too. We'll go check that up. We're going to check that out for damage as well. Maybe right from this angle right here might be a, a, a good spot to do this. Um, oh, just mount, mount the cannon, please. I just need to come up here and look for that. There we go. Reload. That was like right in the front door. I'm a little surprised he's not taking some damage there too. I had 50 of these, I believe. Let's go see what kind of damage we're causing with that. I see the damage here, but is it really... 5889, 8833. Eight, eight, three, three. How did I do on this wall over here? 88, eight, took a couple thousand off of it. You, sir, have to come out of there. I'm going to have to do a lot of that in order to get this door down. Oh, I did it again. It's a stone roof as well, so that's a solid roof. It's not going anywhere. I'll keep going and I'll bring you guys back when we finally get this camp shut down. I want to get in there today. I think we got him out. Maybe not. Nope. Here he is. He's out. We got him out. Yeah, you rascal, you. Get him. Oh, the carnage. Level 10 pirate hiding in there like that. All right, good job, everybody. Jay, for everyone, follow me. Come here, everyone. What a marvelous, marvelous job. Oh, 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 that cannon is in the way. So sorry about that, Bluto. Ooh, okay, everybody stay right there. Oh, the tree came down. All right, nice work, Velma. Nice work. Okay, first thing we're going to do is we're going to claim this here place. Dun, 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 dun. The white flag of pirate peace. What do we got in here? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. oh, now there should be stuff in here. There should be some stuff in here too. We got a treasure chest outside. We'll look at it. I can't. I can't do anything with this stuff. Level up is available. Ooh, really? Okay, all right. Look at this, guys. I got a level today. Uh, stamina. Because we're working on climbing and stuff. We'll spend some points next time. Uh, maybe. I like to really look at the points and see what I want to spend them on. Is there anything in any of these things? Uh... Oh, there we go. There's some food. All right, that's nice. Uh, can we climb this yet? Let's see. Okay, so no, they, they must have taken... Maybe they took her down from there because it's just not fair. Maybe that's the case. How many cannonballs did it take? Where's... Wait, 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 wait. Look, chicken with his head cut off. Where is my treasure box? Where's my box of treasure? An loom and an anvil up here. Anything in the smithy? I can't, oh, oh, squatter, hold on. I can't access that uh, smithy. 
can demolish it. Hmm. There's nothing in the loom. Can I demolish this loom? It doesn't look like... Is it giving me resources? It is giving me resources. That's interesting. But it's not disappearing. Hmm. So you can't really... Yeah, it's just... It's a permanent thing there. Okay, so... Oh, wait a minute. Do we have something over here, too? Oh, we got another building over here as well. I didn't even notice that with the door on it. I wonder if that's where the treasure is. Let's go back in here and see what's back here. What are they... Oh my gosh, I see what that is. It's a window pushed in the ground with a... Oh my god, that is amazing. I've never thought about that. You guys see this? It's locked. Yeah, I, I bet it is. Okay, so where's the dang treasure at? Is it in this other house? Did I walk past it in the other one? Oh, we're going to have to take that door down too now, it looks like. Or do you only get a treasure when you clear all of them? I don't see no treasure in here at all. Maybe we're lined up good enough here? No. Uh, holy cow. There's so many pigs. So many pigs. Um, let's... I gotta weed some of this out. It worked out just great. I mean, that couldn't have been... That was pretty easy just to get uh, that taken care of right there. Come here, you. Come here. Come here, you fighting swine. Now, do you guys have stuff on you? No, you don't. You're just walking cool, huh? All right. Let me get these guys out of the way and all lined up, and then we'll uh, we'll move forward. I want to knock down that other door because I'm really curious now as to what's in there. So it uh, shouldn't take me too long to do that. Got it. Aha! Uh -huh. Treasure. I want to open this. Looks like there's nothing in it.
Is there no treasure? Is there no treasure? I don't get it. Oh. <laughs> it took some cannonballs. I thought the last time I was here, the treasure was sitting down here on the ground in a box. I could have sworn that was the case. I feel like I'm missing something here. Yeah, I can't access these at all. It's got a pin code. It says me. I'm the owner. So why can't I get into it? Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. It says they're all locked and stuff. So I don't know. Hmm. That doesn't seem right that I get no treasure for beating the, the treasure area. Got some berries on you, huh? Look at you, You're just cramming them in. Like so. There we go. Uh, I'm gonna actually put these over here on Velma to take back. We've not found the other uh, two pirate camps. We know the one has got the. Uh, this one over here has got the beach. This one behind us here that we can see from. We can see it from somewhere around here. It's nearby this one here. Uh, fill your water. It's free. <clears throat> but that one has a ship out in the ocean. So I wonder um, if I go into his inventory. What does he have left for cannonballs? Two cannonballs left. That's it. Uh, so yeah, that's not going to work. We're going to have to make some more of those before we even decide to go up against any more camps. We're going to need a lot more of those, as a matter of fact. More than I thought. Um, we're going to have to really get on the cannonball creativity here. Uh, I believe I have a bunch of stuff at home uh, that we could use to, uh, to put those together. I'm just... Now I see there's a red pirate flag still up there. Let's go take a look at this flag one more time. Is there anything I missed? It said I captured it. I'm going to leave it there and see what happens. I can't do anything with any of these things. Yeah, these are just their, these are their things. But I am, again, a little surprised that I don't have... The treasure would be in the middle of camp. I mean, that's just where they would protect it. I just don't see anything uh, anywhere in here that says treasure to me other than that box that was in that building right there. All right. Well, let me know. Let me know. Have I done a radio thing here, or is there just no treasure there, or do I have to get all of them? Uh, maybe I have to get all of them, or just the right camp. I don't know. Uh, let's go ahead and hit you, uh, or J, I should say. Everybody's going to follow me. Oh, there's B. All right, I'm going to take everybody back home, and uh, we'll move on to whatever is going to be next. Walk back. Heat event coming in. These guys can see us, more or less. So we got to go right in. This is the camp that was just a little bit further down the beach. I don't think I ever brought you guys really in to see it. But here we go. It's a nighttime fight. It's dark, I know. Oh, I am stuck here. Oh, I'm on the elephant. That's why. <laughs> it was hog wild. Oh. Hog's gone wild. We need to get these guys off of here. It's not so bad. <laughs> um, let's grab this. It looks to me like most of the fight's over with already. Come on. Come on. Uh-oh, 
oh, 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 oh. I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble here. I'm trying to get out of here. Oh, there we go. There we go. Get some animals in here. It's a fight for our lives. Oh. Oh. Come here, elephant! <laughs> okay, there we go. Oh my gosh. Oh. We still got a guy in a cannon over there. Looks like that's the only one that's left. There's a pirate inside this building over here, too. So that's going to be a thing, huh? Pirates in the buildings. Oh my gosh. Uh, okay, is everybody okay, F4? Her health is just fine. Okay, oh my gosh. All right, wow. Uh, inventory. Why am I coming off of this? She wants to follow Bluto. That's what the problem is here. We need to be right here. I need to get back on Bluto where I belong. And I hit hit you. There we go. Everyone's going to sit still now and not hopefully get shot at anymore. I need to take a health kit and use a health kit real quick. <sighs> Did not have it on my hot bar where it should have been. We've only got a couple cannons left, though, and a guy in a house. So we should be able to shut down a second camp. A little medicine here. Okay, wow. All right, that was fast. All right, there we go, and we're good to go. All right, so we've got a guy still up on this area here. Is there anything? Again, there's nothing really. That's the same as the other one. We got two pirates. We got two pirates inside, indoors, trapped. This looks like it was supposed to be a little different before it came out that way. I'm going to try to use my uh, rifle on this guy. Ooh, there's two of them. F2. Oh, yes, yeah, it's very powerful. F2 in it. You got one more? This one's got somebody up on the ballistas. Let's get some of these trees out of here. There we go. Oh, look at this. We've got her up there. I wonder if this is a way that I could possibly use Velma here to get up to her. To hit her with this sword. Um, hmm. Number six. Can't hook her. Let's see. sword fight she almost dead oh she is dead Velma got her okay so she's down from here now I had to try to kill at least one with my stuff come on oh. 
There we go. There we go. I almost got one. Uh, okay, wow. We have really got everybody just kind of crammed in here, don't we? Everybody's just all crammed up. It, it's difficult with this many... I can't access your inventory or anything like that. Now, how much damage does she cause to this structure? I really would like to know, so I could possibly just use her to do this. Not much. All right, so it looks to me like it's 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 cannons, and that's about it, huh? Hmm. You know, what I did notice is it did I did not have to shoot the door completely off in order to have this work. Uh, it seems like there's a certain point where you hit it, and it kind of gives way. Here we are again. Oh, does it need to be repaired? Um, medium cannonball? Oh, wait a minute. You know what I think it is? Well, I've got him on... him. Is this... It's so tight in here. I can't... I can't see what I'm doing. I'm kind of curious. Is this broken? Do I need to fix this? Mount cannon. Okay, so it's just the angle that he was at. It's just weird, and it's not allowing me to do what I need to do. It's just tight quarters is all. So what if I come up this way? There we go. Sorry about that, guys. There we go. Looks like that's going to work. The cannon is pretty cool. I only have... 20 plus. Now, let's see. Can we get in there? Is our pirate still in here? Oh, th did that pirate come? Oh, I'm sitting here shooting at the wrong dang place. That pirate came out. I did not notice that. So we kind of forced that one out by attacking somebody f up here, I guess. A direct shot to the door. What's it take to get this door down? I think the door kind of changes color once you get uh, a certain amount of damage done to it. That doesn't help me get into that other building, though. We're just going to keep doing this until that door comes down. Let's go check it and see. It's locked, okay. Last time we hit it enough times to where... Now, I just heard it make a sound. It made a different sound there towards the end of that. Okay, the door is off.
Oh, how did I get in here? No, 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 no. I don't want to fight. I'm going to have to fight. Oh. Oh, I don't know how to turn off that day thing. Where it forces you to uh, zoom in. I tried to put the sword away, but it didn't seem to let me. There we go. Uh, so anyways, yeah, there we go. We got that. Level 3 pirate. Caused me a little bit of damage. Um, so did we get this one too? Let's... Nope, there's still a level 1 pirate in there. I did not see that pirate in there a second ago. Now what's going on? Am I just... I'm probably losing my mind. It's probably all me. Oh, there's just boars everywhere. They're in the way. Oh my gosh. I'm not leaving until I get in here. Uh, we've got the other small swivel cannon, but I've got to think that that's not going to cause much damage at all because it's just a little swivel cannon. But this pick is not going to last me all the way through this either. I was kind of hoping that once we got past the halfway mark that it would, uh, you know, not do this. It would allow me to unlock the door. But I'm only getting two per hit. That is going to take me forever to get through that. I've got no more cannons, huh? <sighs> this is awful. I wonder if I should try this guy out and see if maybe... Maybe it'll work. We'll get rid of the cannon. Cannon. Uh, let's demolish it. Let's try this other guy out as well. He doesn't work this way. All right. Well, we can't use him in the back of the cart. So there's that. That doesn't work. So I'm going to have to chop my way through this door here. Am I getting any more damage with my pick as opposed to my axe? It's two. He's quite angry. Uh, I'm betting. I'm betting I might be able to get more damage with uh, Velma here. Okay, I'll be back, guys. This is really difficult. It, it's very close quarters here. I had to return to base. I'm going to get some more cannonballs, but in order to do that, I had to have more metals, so we're back here. I'm hoping that they don't respawn by the time I get back. It's just... Uh, I'm never going to get through that door. It's, it's going to literally take forever to do it. At two, She's only causing two points of damage each time she hits it, and that's all I'm causing, and my pick and my axe are just about shot, so... I don't have what it takes to get through that door. I've got to have some firepower. It looks like that's all there is to it. Now there's those kegs and there's grenades. I'm wondering just how much damage a grenade does when I'm using a cannon on those doors. And it takes a good 20, 25 cannonballs probably to get through the door. Like, like I said, I'm hoping that they don't respawn by the time we get back, uh, back there. I've left everybody there in hopes that that might deter spawning down there. Uh, hopefully, we'll see. I don't know. Uh, it's it's anybody's guess. And I've got to make another cannon too. So there's that. Uh, before we do the cannon balls, let's make a cannon, and I can craft 66 of those. So I'm gonna go ahead and do all of that, <clears throat> and then race back there and see about getting uh, that guy unburrowed from inside there. As a matter of fact, I can actually drop that uh, and that uh, and oh I should probably also fix my tools there we go I wonder if I can actually fix that axe it should be down here at the bottom I think yeah there we go uh, yeah we're not gonna have what we need to in order to do that at the moment I'm gonna have to get some more there's 50 I'm taking them all That should be good. Uh, and then you can carry these guys right here, correct? Uh, that does nothing to his weight. I've got the cannon in my inventory, number six. There you go. And we are back out the door. 
headed back. It's going to be dark out. I'm going to go back and see if I can just get that guy right out of that place. And then maybe, hopefully, hopefully, we'll have two encampments uh, completely taken care of today. And we'll have two more to go. And that will be perfect. So I'll be right back. You better run level part one, pirate. I think I broke through. I did. Let's reload. Well, we've not used this yet. Dead pirate, you're dead. Yeah, there's no, there's no treasure in here. The, 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 the real claim to fame, I guess, about this is the fact that we get to clear the islands, right? Claim attempt failed. One pirate is still in the area. What? There's still a pirate in the area. Is there a pirate up on a rooftop somewhere that I've not noticed? Could be that this is one that's out in the ocean. The cannons are messed up. I don't see another pirate anywhere around here. I wonder if there's one out in the ocean. We must have a pirate ship out here somewhere. I don't... There's got to be. It just has to be a pirate ship that's out there, right? There's no more pirates roaming around in here. Unless there's one trap somewhere that we can't see, possibly. We got the only guy that was in here. It's got to be a ship. Can we climb up this one, this ladder? No, that ladder's also broken. Hmm. Well, it has to be a pirate ship, unless we're waiting for this person to decompose. Perhaps. Okay, I'll come back if I figure this out, or either that or there is definitely a pirate ship just offshore that we can't get to. Oh, there's our pirate. What, where, oh, I bet he was trapped underneath all the in the boars or something here. <laughs> Can't blame him for that. He's right down here. Here he is. And we have F two. Okay, there we go. Now we should be able to claim this camp. Let's go see. I'm not sure where he was. There we go. Okay, so we've got two encampments now. Hmm, okay. Is there anything I can do at all with this stuff? Nah, it's just a set pin code. It's it's my box. I own the stuff. But what if I do just zero? Nothing. I don't I don't know. I don't know what to do there. Let's uh remove that. Yeah, I don't know. But we've got two camps under our belts. There's two down, two to go left on the island. And I leveled up again today. So that actually pays off for leveling most definitely. It sure does. Um, <clears throat> I've leveled twice today battling the pirates. So that's those two. The next thing I'm going to have to do is go down the beach here further to see where the next camp is. I have no idea. Um, just how much farther down it is. We know the one that's got the pirate ship is right next to us. <clears throat> Let's see. Can we get everybody home? 
I think I've got all the boars. We didn't lose anybody today. I'm not quite sure what to do with all these boars. That's why I took the low-level ones. I figured maybe we'd have a fight and they'd, you know, perish a little bit. Because <laughs> we got our really strong ones at home, so I just wasn't... Uh, I don't want a bunch of boars anymore. Uh, this is pretty tricky for them to get over. It's tricky for me to get over. Uh, okay, that's going to have to wrap up today's episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, do hit that like button for me. Comment, subscribe, and share. I'm the Radio Man 3 Have an awesome, fantastic, and a superb day. And I look forward to talking to you again next time. Uh-oh. Velma's having trouble up there.